I go to her mother's room. She says she's sick. She's not there. I go again another night. She has gone again. I listen for her. She comes back late each time like a thief. She does this many times, quietly, leaving open her window. I tell no one. Amjad would, yes, he would be angry. Whether she's with boys, I don't know. Or with Yasmin who came here, I don't know. I say nothing to her. She looks at me in the morning, but I say nothing. She is more far from us. We have lost her, I think. Yes, she must marry soon. She is roaming out there. It is something I can't understand. We are poor people. Where we come from, education is for the rich. But it has changed her. We can't understand. Ramja tells me she smokes. She's a girl. I will miss Samina here, in the house when she's married. No one comes here. She helps me cook and work. I need Amina. We never realized how English she would become. She understands life here more than us. We have not helped her here. I can feel it when she looks at us like a little girl. She needs help. Advice. But we are useless. Our ways are no good for her. She has grown so far from us. We haven't noticed. She's always been a good girl. She's never wore jeans or listened to Bob sings. But she has grown far away. 